All right, people, welcome back. More DM Dope commentary. So we actually have a new person joining me. This is, uh, go ahead and introduce yourself. I'm Shia Souls. Um, I currently have a Pokemon channel, but apparently I'm supposed to be doing Yu-Gi-Oh. Uh, you need to turn your sound off. <laughs> oh, shit, shit, my bad. All right. <laughs> yeah, uh, she has been a, a supporter for me for a long time, and I was like, you know what? You you need to get on here. You need to get on here. So. Uh, despite being a, a Pokemon tuber or whatever the word is, uh, I was like, she joined me. And uh, of course, you are invited to the Yu Gi Oh! Tier Draft League Season 2 if you want to join. Thank you. I'll try my best to make you to it. <laughs> All right. So, uh, link in the description to Shuya's channel. Ton of Pokemon content. Uh, I used to do Pokemon content. <laughs> But, no, yeah. that was in the past. Yeah, yeah I, mean, I still like playing Pokemon. I'm still excited for my uh, my Sun and Moon. <laughs> Most definitely. So, uh, we're supposed to be doing the under commentary. I uh, got Yuri Fusions here at only 419, but he's getting starting up. And we have Team Dusk Prime Material at 1154, playing that uh that balanced card card D. <laughs> hmm. Oh my God, like. It seems like they can't get any more balance than card card D. Like it's a perfect amount of drawback and plusing that that's deservingly so for a card like Podigree. I feel like they'll try their hardest too. Definitely, maybe they'll come out with a better Podigree. Well, not I wouldn't say a better Podigree, but I see yeah. a worse than one later on. I mean, they got Pot of Cupidity. <laughs> not good enough. Oh my I god! Dump out like what ten cards into wow. your bandage zone. <laughs> you got it. <laughs> Okay, Mr. You, Hero. <laughs> I heard you like Shadow Mist. <laughs> wow. Holy crap. <laughs> Just get jumped by Shadow Mist. <laughs> All right. Yeah. I don't think I've ever done anything like that. <clears throat> so we're just kind of waiting for Danklaw. So I'm guessing this is PK, PK Heroes from what it looks like, since we're seeing the, the Phantom Knight wings. Uh, true, true. Do you think we'll see any uh, Dark Rebellion uh, Requiem? Um, this is uh, TCG only, so they uh, don't have their rank up. Oh, I seriously doubt those two the attacks will get in. Okay, what's he playing? Some psychic deck. Some psychic deck, maybe maybe side frames. Uh, probably. There goes the hero we'll limbs have... and vanities. Mm. I, saw, I seriously doubt the attacks will go through, but I mean, two, I mean the three set cards. Probably one of them is like a mirror force or Solomon or something. That would be. <laughs> All them Crimson Blader attacks getting it in. Uh, you only get one Denklaw, I mean Shadow Mist effect per turn, only once a turn, right? Yeah, so. Yeah. Doesn't matter if you just keep on sitting into the graveyard. You only get one search this turn. Then it's for another Bubbly, alright. Special summon that Bubbly. Are we getting the OTK maybe? Maybe. No? Well. No. Go ahead and catch this Rippling Mirror Force. Or Drowning Mirror Force. That's how that comes from a mile away. Saw that coming from a mile away. Sit down. Call. Wow. A crazy neg on that one. That hurts. <laughs> <laughs> he tried his best. Damn. That and that and all you got is one bubble man. Actually, you know what? Mm. Oh my god, is Bubble Man actually gonna resolve his effect? Someone did this on their YouTube channel. I forgot who did that. Oh that my god, like, go wow. ahead, Rain Face 2. If this card's the only card in your hand, you special summon it, you can draw two cards. Let's not control no other cards when you do it. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> Let's go. Strike that. I would strike the living. If you have a set strike, I'd strike the hell out of that. Like, hell or no. warning, I don't care. Something. What, whatever. Do not let him get that effect. <laughs> He's such in a good position right now. He has no cards. Wow. I, that, I think that might have been the first time I saw Bubble Man, Bubble Man actually get that effect off. Right. Usually they have something, but nope. Wow. Why do you why do you let it go? I mean, Maybe his set cards aren't anything to stop him. Mm-mm, mm-mm, mm-mm. Mm. Now he's kinda of back into this duel. <laughs> wow. Bubble man for the win. <laughs> Alright. Is he still at two in the OCG? I think so. Yeah. <laughs> I'll actually double check. I think he might be at two in the OCG. I know Shadow Miss is at one and yeah. Mass Change Second is at one. They're like, yeah, we don't really like heroes over here. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he actually resolved that effect. A bubble man. It's the first of everything, I guess. Mm-hmm. 
that rippling mirror point helped. They're like, oh, yeah, <laughs> look at that. Hmm. I guess not. What is this? Oh, so it is side frames. Alright. Oh, okay. Interesting. I kind of wanted to see more of this deck. Me too. There's a good, there's, there's an, I mean, not a good chance. This deck will, will definitely be in Yu Gi Oh! Tier Draft League Season 2, so it's good to go ahead and see more of it. And I might, I don't know, it depends on if the card is on the end, I'm not sure, but I might allow the new Cyprim monster guy. I I mean, it, it, at least it helps the deck out. Mm hmm. Ah, it's Diffusion Norton. Diffusion. <laughs> oh, Norton, I still hate you. <laughs> 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 yeah, so I get. I mean, now I see why Prime is taking it so slow in the card card D, but I'm kind of wondering where the hell are all your side frame cards? Like, I'm waiting for you to, you know, gate with some powerful side frame cards, play your field spell, bust out expensive ass Omega. Like, who is that? <laughs> <the> good... <laughs> yep. How much is Omega nowadays? Well, uh, almost 40 bucks. Oh, it's cool. I'm sitting on 40 bucks. All right. <laughs> oh, you got one? Yeah. Yeah, hold on to that. That's probably going to go up when uh, Sage comes out. Yeah. The Sage, that's a one card Omega right there. That play is so ridiculously good. Castell. So I guess you're going to try to spin the over overload. I wonder if he's going to allow him to get that or is he actually going to pitch to pop it on summon? Hmm. Huh? No, he's going to pop you. <laughs> on seven, get popped. There's driver. God, and Cyphering guy is running out of materials and uh, cards to play. You need to get something. What do you mean, chain? No, on summon. No. <laughs> on summon. Yes, yeah, to summon. summon. Yeah, on the summon. Okay. Hit you with it before you even activate your effect. A chain. What does Castell look like? Spell speed <laughs> tricking two? You wish. If he spell P2, he'd be broken. I mean, he's already kind of broken, but... <laughs> not as much as he needs to be. Yeah. Just because he's just so generic and so abused. Like, th there is no... Uh... Oh, he's messaging me. Uh, are you recording this still? <laughs> <laughs> so used. Like, you can't say rank... You can't say rank four without saying Castell. Castell. <laughs> All right. Get his uh his powerful match charge and look at that. That bubble man seriously got him into this duel. All right. <laughs> Prime is just like awesome. <laughs> like wow, just right back into this duel. Do you think that's a car card D in his hand? I don't even know. Oh, wow. And acid. <laughs> well, gonna get rid of it one way. Yeah. Wow. Wow. Prime, you just opened up. Terrible. Was that double overload? Yep. Thanks. I think it was the car card D. He would have played it last turn. He didn't really do much True. the previous turn, so I don't know. It looks like he's already pattering it out. He he had he had Yuri on the ropes, man. But then you just let him resolve. Well, he didn't let him. He resolved that. I mean, double overload. What does overload even do? Uh, you pass turn. You can banish this card. Add one Cypher card from your deck to your hand, except for Cypher yes. Overload. Wow. All right. Go ahead and add your field spell. Yep. 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 And go ahead and add Beta. That stops. Uh, what? When a monster declares an attack. Yep. Yeah, buddy. All right. I think you might be able to. He yeah, had two psychics in uh, the banish already. Yeah, he banished uh, two with uh, the two when he used overload twice. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so never mind. I thought Prime was out of it. There were a couple of cards, and Prime is back in it. Yep. Yeah, buddy. Okay. Okay. Yep. Uh, you got one turn. I said. Well, maybe. I'm debating on it. I'm kind of. I wanted to make it a tier two deck. That way, they don't get many points if someone selects it as a tier three deck. But I think it's worthy right. of a tier two deck. It's a very strong deck, you know. Especially if I'm willing to allow you to get that new cipher guy. I forgot his name. The Threader, right? Yeah, the one in. Uh, in. I forgot what the the, the set is called. 
this uh, invasion of chaos, right? No, not not uh, uh, invasion, invasion not, of venom. Yeah, not invasion of chaos. chaos. <laughs> Yeah, Konami's gonna go back in the past and put more cards in it. <laughs> if you didn't know, Konami had a time machine. <laughs> wow, and Yuri over here is not doing anything like that. I mean, that's pretty much how you beat this uh, side frame. You just don't do anything, but it's kind of difficult to win when you're not gonna attack, you're not gonna summon, you're not gonna play any spells or traps. You're just kind of sitting there. All right, summon Bubble Man. That's fine. Again. Again. Oh, did we ever figure out what Bubble Man was at in the OCG? Mm -mm. I couldn't find anything on it. Uh, uh, if you go on, like, DevPro, and then when you select what list, and then you search the card, it should show what the card's at. I would do it, but, you know, I'm screen recording. <laughs> Looks like three. I'm gonna just double check. It looks like three to me. I have it on the OCG, the latest one. I can call All right, type in like, type in like I don't know what the card that they have at one. Type in ah oh, fuck sorcerer, pendulum sorcerer. Still is going absolutely. Got that Starlight Road. Oh, you can just negate it with, uh, yeah. I'm kind of worried about that. Like, you don't want to pop the circuit. Hmm. Ouch. Yep. Yep. Get wrecked. You still, no, you can't find Sorcerer? No, man. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna look on, uh, Wiki. Who they have. I feel like they would tell me to. Oh, you missed a pretty good play. The hero player went twin twister and targeted the set card that Prime set in his filth spell. And he had a, a, one of his cipher monsters to negate, but he flipped warning upon that. So, no summon, no negate. And got his filth spell and stuff wrecked. <laughs> so, ouch. Here he's going to then flip summon that Shadow Mist once again. See the bowman in the shadow mist for I mean I seriously doubt you're gonna get your direct attack in. But uh there's someone driving by on the motorcycle hella fast, like alright. They have it at one. Bubble man's at one? Yeah. No, uh sorcerer. Okay. Uh, let me yeah. look up bubble man. I just I just wanted to be, you to do the web uh on Dev Pro because it would make sure it's on Dev Pro's I mean like OCG's list. I'm just fucking up all over the place. Alright, summon, summon. Yep. Uh, apparently he's at three. Okay. So, I know he got hit, but I guess they decided to go ahead and up it. So, do you like destroy the monster or something? Um, yeah, you do. Oh, okay. Just to summon it, destroy the attacking monster, then end the battle phase. Okay, mm -hmm. so the battle phase is ended. Wow, Beta, so good. I feel um, like they need one more side frame monster to like negate something. Don't they have everything? Can't they negate everything? Or is there something that they're missing? I feel like they're missing something. A no direct attack. You know it ends the battle phase, right? Yeah. And then, did you just special summon that bubble man during the battle phase? <laughs> <laughs> you're telling me that you detach the, the shadow mist because you're going to be destroyed. Search for shadow mist, special summon the bubble man, and then still conduct your battle phase. Cool story, bro. Cool story. <laughs> because that's a legit new game nowadays. Mm -hmm. So, aren't these cards like banished during the end phase? During the end phase, banish the, the. Banish. Best phase up monster special summon by this effect. Mm. So without that fill spell to go ahead and synchro summon during your opponent's turn, it kind of hurts. Oh, Trap Chick's Wrath too? I don't think that hurts too much. They got like 
Zeta and Omega, so they could just hop out the way. So, yeah. Guess they do have everything that negates something. Never mind. I said I think it's gonna be interesting if we keep this deck as a tier two, and that means that someone has to play it in the league. I don't know. It's debatable. I might just say no to it being it, and then decide otherwise if someone selects it. Cause I'm. I, I, I kind of feel like the deck's kind of boring. It's like interesting but boring at the same time. It's just a lot of waiting. That's not ever fun. Yeah, so I don't think it'd be very entertaining. So I, if, I, if I say, if I don't even put it as a tier 2, I don't even think anybody's even going to select it as a tier 3. I could maybe state otherwise, like, eh, it's kind of boring. I don't want to just forbid it from the league, but I'm right. not sure. Is that it? Is that game? It looks like game. Yep. <laughs> We can maybe leave it up to the viewers. Maybe do like a straw poll. Yeah. Twin Those are usually fun. To pop that set, I guess. And then I guess negate your own card. Now I'm confused. We... Okay. okay, so he's going to declare an attack. He's going to go Twin Twister to pop his set card. And then negate the direct attack with Beta. Which means that Wings is going to protect Acid from dying from Beta. And then, of course, those two are going to get banished once again. Like, you really need that filled spell. Like, <laughs> you need to synchro summon during your opponent's turn. You're just going to lose everything. Dang. Like, holy crap. Still got nothing? <laughs> no. Do not feel like that car card D of that rippling mirror force. <laughs> or drowning mirror force again. Number gen the number generator is messing with them right now. <laughs> yeah, there we go. All right. Oh, that's game one. Just got rid of his felt spell and shook them out. And then the side frames to play. All right, we'll be back for game two. All right, game two. So Pan is going first. All right, you got that nice uh, circuit set up. Like, that that new monster is definitely helpful. Go ahead and pitch it to protect and uh, the Kensa driver. Like. Definitely seems like it would help. So, like I said, it really depends. Cause I kind of feel like it's just kind of a boring deck. It's so passive that it's kind of boring. It's like borderline not interacting with your opponent. Because if your opponent doesn't do anything, you're not doing anything. Right. So it's just like so it's like <laughs> it's like why are we dueling if nothing's going on? Mm-hmm. So that's how I feel about the deck right now. I mean, I find it interesting and it's cool when we see it out here on DM Door commentary. But I think it would be get kind of boring if we just kept seeing it on uh on in league for the next year <laughs> yeah i say wait on uh if you don't decide to go ahead with the deck this year i say just wait on it for next year at least that way someone will have time to play with um the threader and like any other new support that may come out for it Ooh, all right was that an anti-spell mm. Kind of hurts. Good thing he already has his, uh, his circuit up, so he's not too slow on the draw. But very fusion over here. <laughs> Imperial I'm with the plays now. Yep. Uh, yeah, I mean, this upcoming season it's going to be a long thing. It's it's going pretty much it's going to be till 2017. <laughs> like holy crap! Like it's going to be a long time. But, uh, a fun season right there. Oh, yeah. It's going to be fun. It's going to be fun. Thank you for joining. <laughs> no problem. Thank you for inviting me. Um, I enjoyed watching it, but I feel like... Uh, you're like, I, 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 could, I could do that. In there. Yeah. <laughs> Seems like something I could do. No, I, I, if you guys are wondering what the progress of this, I'm almost, I'm almost there. I think I have, I want to say, 15 confirmed people out of 16. There's one person who's saying maybe, and then there's one person that if that person doesn't say yes, then I'll invite. So we're almost there. So we should be starting. I'd say I'd say July, I'd say early July. Because of course I still got to get the word out there, which means that of course I gotta work with Slate and get all them uh, Yugi tubers to allow me to guest upload <laughs> again. Uh oh. Yeah, so that should be fun. I wanted to invite P Bunny, but. Bunny didn't even give me the time of day. It would be someone being less subscribers than me. I was like, hey. <laughs> With his racist ass self. I'm still mad at him for that. 
I ran into him at the YCS, and he was like, "Hey, aren't you Cali Effect?" It's oh. <laughs> like, "Oh, and aren't you Asian Eyes?" <laughs> <laughs> Like, no, I'm not the Cali effect. <laughs> yes, I do know Marcus, but... Oh, okay. Hmm. Goes in that, so each player can only control one attribute. I think he might want to have that bubbly man, because he's probably going to turn that into acid and wipe yeah. your butt. So, you're going to go ahead and send the Shadow Mist and the Monk and stick with the bubbly man, then turn to acid and wipe everything? I wonder if this deck runs like Starlight Road or something. I feel like it does. Cause especially with like twin twisters and stuff, like getting your, your sales spell cracked and you don't have that monster yet, like seems like be very important to go ahead and make sure that you don't get completely wrecked. And that's my phone going off. Probably someone wishing me happy God damn it. <laughs> <laughs> it is someone wishing me happy birthday. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Never fails. Nope. Oh, well, wait, don't, it's attribute. Yeah, what's it say? You never summon a Crimson Blader because it was on the summon resolution summon of Bubble Man. You can go ahead and flip Ghost Man, which means that right now you need to go ahead and send the monsters that, uh, for which attribute you want. What is this guy doing? It's tight, it's, it's not, it's attribute, right? Not tight. Yeah. So... You're gonna stick with water. I'm confused. I'm Don't confused. Say it's not warrior, bro. No, it's not warrior. No, 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 no. Not type attribute. Water or dark. I know it's not. It's not done very often, but no, 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 no. no. <laughs> what are you doing? I know. What are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> exactly. Tell this man, does. Tell this man, prime material. Not type. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> what do you mean, okay? <laughs> do you want dark or do you want water? Mm, okay, water. That's what I thought. So you can go into acid. You better have a mass change, still. Um, you want to go ahead and put that samurai back? Because he was never summoned? <laughs> I guess not. Whatever. Fuck him. Fuck him. Gotta get a samurai, <laughs> apparently, somewhere. I don't even know how he got summoned to the field, because that was at the resolution of Bowman, man. But whatever. These are the pro people on... Uh, under, well, I can't really say that. Yuri doesn't have too high of a rating. So... Mass <clears throat> change into, into acid, I'm assuming? That's the reason why you kept it? Oh, there's Bubble Man. Another one? Really? That's not even necessary. You know that you can't exceed into anything that's a different attribute than water. Didn't you just set that? He's still learning the game. I think Yuri just said that. I remember him just saying that. I'm not sure if it was this turn or last turn. I remember that just getting set. I think it was this turn, actually. No, 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 no. It was last turn. It was last turn. Damn. Damn. Because he went monk, pitch, summon, search, last turn, and then set up last turn. Yep, that's last turn. You're good. So, damn. And once again, damn, acid. Dust, man, dust. Yep, and, uh, yep. That was also set last turn, so it's diffusion. For, of course, Norden, because Norden's totally fair. <laughs> <laughs> and you can't do this. It'd be nice if he got banned. Like, shit. I, I mean, OCG tried him at one. Oh. He was at, uh, no, what was it, Instafusion at one? And Norton yeah. was at three, and then they flipped it, and Institution went up to three. Norton was banned, but I guess we're like, hey, maybe if we hit Norton to one and have three Institution, and then bring back Thousand Eyes, then everybody will play three Institutions. Fuck that cookie cutter shit, like fucking playing no. triple upstart. Dweller, what the fuck is Dweller supposed to do against freaking Cyphers? Maybe he's just trying to get that that uh, that boost, but I mean, one water. Okay. I guess. Yep, it's all water monsters game 500. Yep, all water monsters yep. game 500. So 13, 22, and damn, look at look at acid over here. Okay, now you block it. So you take the 13, but then block it. 
Alright, gonna go ahead and wings and prepare. I thought that Yuri over here was playing freaking PK heroes, but it just looks like pure heroes, and he's thrown in phantom wings just because why not? Hey, when you got it, you got it. Right? Oh, right, because you destroy the monster, so you're like, screw it, I'll take the bubble man and then block the acid because I'm gonna kill the acid, but nope, he had the wings. I saw that PK heroes, I mean, that, that's pretty interesting. Yep, vanished once again. And now you're down to one card. Awesome. And even if you do have your filled spell with terraforming, no, you gotta set it. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> Damn. Damn. Anti spell is fucking fry. <laughs> Shit on your life. <laughs> I think that might be it. Unless that other set card is actually like some back row, I think that's it. If, if. Yuri can dish, dish out enough damage, because I don't think that's enough. 13, 22. It's going to be Drowning Mirror Force. Yeah, if it's if it, if it, if it, if that Drowning Mirror Force, then nice. Oh yeah, Detach that Shadow Mist, get a search. That might be enough, because it's still 22, 13, 31, and then whatever, whatever else. Plus maybe a Cowboy, that might be good. Right, get another Bubbly Man. Bubble Man MVP of this video. <laughs> <laughs> That's sad. I haven't seen a single Denklaw all fucking game. But That's God... good though, right? <laughs> yeah, goddamn, we've seen. Wow, you didn't want to summon that summon that Bubble Man as well? I guess you. Oh, if you get hit with the Ripple of Mirror Force, you're like, oh no, nah, screw that. At least I will have one monster. All right, 31, 22, 13. Main phase two, summon that Bubble Man. Go for a cowboy. One one hundred left. Come on, cowboy. Come on, cowboy. Show me potato salad. <laughs> <laughs> wow. No cowboy. Really, Yuri? I'm disappointed in you. Now watch frickin' Prime come back. That should be quite hilarious. Okay. Wait, wait, I special summon. All right, so you return those two and then special summon this uh, synchro monster. That takes synchro monster. Wow, that feels them though. That seems like it'd be really good inside frames. It's decent, but you really have to rationalize it. Like either play it at one or two. Mm -hmm. Three is just gonna be too cloggy, regardless. Because these sufferings don't get banished all the time. Yeah. Oh, wow, because Yuri doesn't have a cowboy. Prime might be back to this game. Maybe. Like, wow. Like, what? what is in your extra deck? Like, what is possibly in your <laughs> extra deck? Because there's no way that you have that many cards in your extra deck that you don't have cowboy. Like, you, you should have a toolbox of rank fours. Like, every rank four under the sun that you think will be helpful should be in there. And cowboy should be at least in the top ten. Definitely number one. That should be the first card you put in your deck. And Nolas Castell. <laughs> like, oh, I can do rank fours. All right, Castell. Then, then probably Dweller. Because Dweller's getting up there, too. I mean, it's not that helpful in this duel in particular. But... Chain. All right. And then they're banished till what? The next down phase? Is that what they did us? Mm-hmm. Some monsters, the big technician grabs both the monsters, turn in during your next semi phase, discard in your graveyard, you can target one other separate card, and your graveyard, return it to the extra deck. Return this card to extra deck if you do. Add that target to your hand. Ooh, ooh, that's good. <laughs> Don't fuck with Zeta. It's just no one plays him because no one's always shadowed. <laughs> I mean, he's not terrible, it's just. He's a, it's a little bit harder to hop out of the way, like, in comparison to Omega. At least Omega lets you put your uh, banished stuff back in the graveyard. I'm going to hit and hit this man up with the Twin Twisters, just in case, even though it's probably nothing. Yep. <laughs> and I guess wrap this duel up. Unless that last card in the hand is... Beta. Yeah, yeah Beta. <laughs> Alright, now let's push summon the bubbly man. Go for cowboy? No. Alright, that may be the cowboy there. Beta. Beta. Nope. Alright. Nope. Alright, that's a game! <laughs>
Okay. That was a fine duel. And we're actually going to call that a video. So, uh, thank you. I don't, how do you say your name again? The YouTube Shia. name? Shuya. 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 No problem. All right. Thank you for joining me. Looking forward to seeing how well you do and uh, you get to your draft league season too. So thanks for watching. Thank support. And uh, be sure to click the link in the description. Go to Shuya's channel. Uh, that's that Pokemon content. I, guys, I know you guys love Pokemon. Come on. Who's not hyped for that sun and moon, right? <laughs> exactly. Uh, go ahead and click the link. Go to, to his channel. Watch his content. Support and subscribe. And uh, come back in, in uh, a couple hours and have uh, enjoy Daily Duels with Shuya joining me in tagging. All right, people. Thanks for watching.